joining fam. Happy Christmas Eve. So by the time you're seeing this, I'm pretty sure Christmas Eve would have already passed because my vlogs are a little bit late. I had family here, right? We had family and so when I was trying to give them my undivided attention in a sense, so I didn't get to put out as many videos as I would like, so I'm a little bit behind, but I'm still, I still have lots of footage. I've been filming along the way, but I'm currently downstairs right now. I was trying to tackle this area. We have our little wrapping station right here. This is one of the Christmas um, wrapping paper that we decided to use this year from Costco. Really, really love this because it is double-sided. Like, I love this side. This one is just like, you know, basic Santa. Um, the other one that came in the pack looked like this, kind of like candy cane. And then I've got this whole um, color scheme over here that I have yet to use. So the wrapping is going um, in the midst of it all. We just had Zoe's birthday. So we took down all the decorations already. Usually I leave them up for another an extra day or two, but I did take them down. Um, anyways, the agenda for now is to get some of this wrapping done, particularly Babe's presents and uh, the ones for the girls who have left because I know he hasn't done those ones yet. Babes and two of the girls ran out, Mikhail and Charlotte, they ran out to do some last minute shopping. Shout out below, leave a comment down below. Let me know if you are a last minute shopper. Like I said, this year I have felt amazing because I haven't had to worry about Christmas shopping. I did the greater majority at Roots when I went to their like sale or whatever, but there are a couple little knickknacks that I wanted to do. They're more like stocking stuffers for the kids that I wanted to grab today. I know it's so last minute, but like I said, we had family basically here until day before yesterday. It's been like a full day or maybe a full two days since we haven't had anyone here. The one day was basically just kind of like reset and then it was basically Zoe's birthday and then we're here, it's the day after that. So it's just been like really, really busy. Also, I just grabbed a box of stuff from Old Navy and it came, but they're all so big. Like, I think I ordered the wrong size. I basically ordered some sweaters. I do have a gift, Christmas gift or two in here. This one is mine. This is what I'm supposed to kind of wear tomorrow, but I think I might have to exchange it because it, I bought a large and I'm not sure I like the way it fits. That's another thing that I'm running into. So I have a gift or two in this bin, this box that I need to possibly return or exchange, but I'm, I guess I don't have to rush into it because I know we're not going anywhere come Christmas. It will be a little different, but it's also, you know, it's also nice and cozy to just be with Mama, your own family. Two point four. These came in the box, these pajama sets. They were seven bucks from Old Navy for the whole set, which was really cute for baby boy. They're in size two, so they're not expected to fit him this year, next year perhaps, but I'm gonna put those up. I didn't know if I was gonna wrap them. The girl just made herself a quick little lunch. This is how I like to eat my little stir fry bowl. I put a lot of sriracha on there just to give it a nice little kick. I'm really trying to get my eating back together. When, um, if you guys saw, when my sister-in-law was here, she, was make, she made all types of food and it was so, so delicious, but I was eating things that I don't typically eat. Like I was eating like potatoes with rice and, um, in a wrap like it was delicious but i couldn't i can't eat like that on all the time especially for me that's trying to lose like the baby weight it's been a bit of a struggle so i am definitely trying to get back on track with my eating so i can just get to the place that i need to I, well, i've been walking a little bit here and there but i'm not consistent with it as much as i'd like to do it daily and I've been doing this walk with this girl named Walk. Her name is like, her channel's called Grow With Joe. And I've been walking with her here and there. I also walk with this woman called Paula B. Hers is like, it's like we're walking for over 50. But it's actual workout. Like I, I walk with her and I like what she does because I am like a big fan of aerobics. But I definitely can't wait till when I can you know, get back to the gym a little bit. I don't know when that's gonna happen, but I also have a gym in my basement, so I literally have no excuse.
clearly we're not done wrapping. Like, how do you wrap some of these gifts that are a little bit awkward? I don't know. know. We'll see. I would just like use kind of paper lost. to just kind of smush it together, patch, make it into like patchwork. We're currently running out of like tags. This is the end of it. So we're just going to be writing. I've already started writing the names of gifts on top of the, just on the wrapping paper. That's all I can do at this point. It's Christmas Eve and places are actually closed. I think there are a few places that are open, maybe like the drugstores and stuff like that, but definitely not like the stores that I'd want to go to get that kind of stuff. And I didn't realize that we were running that low when these guys were on the street. Unless I would have said maybe to get some. Yeah, go on. Huh? No. We didn't even get these at Michael's. We got these at Indigo. Oh. Yeah. Well, this is sweet. Yeah, she said she wanted to help, and I thought it was really good. So, I, she doesn't have to do it perfectly. I want her to take part in her brother's gift. I thought that was really nice. This is like a very, very special thing that you're doing, Zoe. What a nice surprise for your brother, Zoe. Let me see. You take this seriously, I see. She takes it very seriously. Okay. okay. Wow. Let me, let me cut. I'm wrapping a present for you, Daddy. Oh, that's nice. Okay, just a minute, so, so, uh We just have to. Get this. Also, guys, look what just look what I just got. I got a new pop socket for my phone because the case was falling apart. The phone case that I'm using is an OtterBox case. These cases are apparently meant to like prevent your phone from. I don't know, being destroyed. I can't say much because honestly, <laughs> the phone case itself was destroyed. So we called in to get it replaced and they replaced it. But this is not the original case that I was using. And this one, I just didn't like the feel of it. It was so, it's so slippery. It's so slippery and it was really, really hard to hold. So unless I had a pop socket, it wasn't working out and I'm so happy I got one. I did, however, order one from Amazon that I have to cancel because it wasn't gonna get sent out till like the 28th. So I gotta double check that to see if it's been shipped. Uh, let's keep my fingers crossed. Anyways, if you guys wanna see what I got the family for Christmas, check out the link in the description box for my mommy channel because I actually just posted a video on that showing the haul from this, um, my roots haul that I bought for the whole family. Definitely check it out because then you guys can see the full, you can get the full experience. I think one, come on Christmas day when we open the gifts, I will kind of show you what I got the kids for Christmas since I didn't do it in a separate video. It was my intentions, but honestly, it was just a lot. I just didn't have any time given that we had family and it's just been, I, yeah, it's just been really, really busy. I just ate something real quick because these guys picked up a salad and some wedges on the on the street because it's gonna be kind of like a busy cozy night it's christmas eve right it'd be ideal to want to cook but no not happening i would take up the tripod and show the, the video show their finished product real quick i'll show it to you in a minute but i don't want to move the tripod because my tripod is broken and i need to replace it it's ghetto should have been a christmas gift <laughs> i should have requested this as a christmas gift what do you think so? but um good job i love it Yes. Tonight we're going to be watching Encanto. <laughs> this, this one's been waiting. They've been waiting for this movie for, for months. Months, really? Because we were waiting all of November. We were like, oh, it's coming out the 24th of November. And then we were we didn't go see it in theaters. We were waiting until it came out on Disney+. Plus. Because, you know, we live in a household, small children, COVID numbers, bad. <laughs> well, yeah, but not even that. The fact that it is, it's like, they're gonna put it, they were gonna put it, it basically came out in theaters a month ago and they were gonna put it on Disney Plus oh, Disney in, a in a month. In a month, yeah. Why would you not wanna save your money? Between all the three of them going to the theaters, it would have been like 40, 50 bucks. Cause you wanna actually buy, t t your tickets alone, I think it's like $15, if not more. Then you'd have to buy stuff when you go there. So think about it. I know. Yeah. So you guys so saved. We waited. We, you waited we and saved yourselves a ton, and now we're actually all gonna get to watch it together. Isn't that I more know, exciting? Yeah, that's way more exciting. So yeah, that's what we're gonna watch tonight. It's a really nice ever. Christmas gift, and yeah, it's basically all I wanted. That's basically what we're gonna do. <laughs> <laughs> Dad's and like, then, what do you want for Christmas? I'm like, well, I want to okay, watch Encanto when it comes. Mm -hmm. And then we're, I think we want to watch Miracle on 34th Street. The Grinch. And maybe. the Grinch. So it'll be an all night. It'll be a long night. <laughs> it will be. Hopefully it'll pass out. Okay, you you, you don't pass out. That's why I'm watching Encanto first. That's a lie. I stay up late, girl. I stay up late. You passed out last night on the first episode of Merlin. We watched like three. <laughs> but that was at like three, probably like two o'clock. 
I did well. Mm, yeah, yeah. We considering were, considering I, I wake up er, considering I wake up at like 7:30 every morning. She does. I wake up at 7 30 no matter what time we go to bed. So. I, yeah, I know. I wake up early no matter what time we go to bed. I just don't get out of bed. Before. Yeah, and like, you go I, back, I just, but then you go back to sleep. Yeah, <laughs> that's not what sleep. I do. I have to take care of kids, okay, Jamie. So mm -hmm. And I'm constantly like breastfeeding and. You know, with you know the whole nine yards. Yeah, and yeah, if he's yeah. awake, he's probably not gonna fall. So this morning, I did wake up early, and I kind of, I wasn't feeling very well, to be fair. Was not feeling very well. But then, you know, that subsided, thank the Lord. And now, we're getting on with the day. Actually, this vlog also started rather late. It started well into the evening. Well, yeah, I would say after two, because when Aaron and the kids decided to go out, it was after two o'clock, so. But and that's when I picked up the camera. So I did start it late, but let's see what else I can wrap real quick while the kids are not down here because only one kid isn't down. One kid is not down. Well, um, I'm gonna banish you guys. While the kid isn't down here. While the kid isn't down here. Debbie, say hi. Say hi. No one's dressed in their Christmas pajamas. None of us are in our pajamas yet. We should get them on. Also, I was like last minute trying to think about like Christmas dinner. I was like, oh my gosh, because normally, normally when we're at my mom's, she worries about all that stuff. And she's wor she will have like all the things planned out. And then I was like, wait a second, I'm staying home this year. What are we gonna eat on Christmas day? Nice, yeah. <laughs> That's a good question. Air. Yeah. Snow. So then, so the best. <laughs> right. So then, last minute, I had to like tell them I was, you might want to stop at the grocery store to pick up some stuff so we can actually have food. I know this is like, what am I thinking? You know. But sir, Dad. sir, sir. What? 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 Watch this. You only come to me for one thing and one thing only. What? Do you, what do you want? <laughs> what, what do you want? I wonder. What do you want? Say it. What do you want? Oh my gosh! <laughs> you can't see him here. Like this. <laughs> <laughs> No, he's upset again. Are you keeping some presents under the tree here, sir? <laughs> I can't. He yeah, he so went from happy to sad in like an instant. Okay, guys, so I know, I mean, we're in the same spot, but we're actually done. I think we're like one gift away from um, being everything being wrapped. Um, I don't know, I was trying to debate if I should wrap some clothes for Zoe. I think I probably should just wrap it, and then I'll be done. Someone's waiting. Are you just waiting to count down? Yep. <laughs> you don't want to fall asleep watching Encanto now, do you? I will never fall asleep. <laughs> That's what I thought. I was saying to Charlotte that there was a year when we actually put this many gifts under the tree for just the three girls. And I don't know what we were thinking because that was a year when I learned like less is more. We got them so many different things and I thought they would be like over the moon, which they were. I just think they were overwhelmed. So, um, we, I feel like this time around we definitely try to get them some of what they want for sure but being reasonable at the same time like not overdoing it because there's a lot to buy and you can keep buying and buying but in our darkest moment we were given a miracle a candle which gave a magical brain that could never go out to be assembling Zoe's kitchen. Is there like a picture you can have for reference? Okay, no. But these are all the pieces that it comes with and how long do you think this is gonna take? 20 minutes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 20 minutes. Hopefully 20 <laughs> minutes. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> oh, right, how long so do you think cute. it's gonna take? Look at this. That's so cute. What's this for? I have no idea. Anyway, we will 
show you guys what it looks like when it's done. So guys, it is actually three, it is what, it's three, four, it's almost four o'clock in the morning. And I think you guys would have seen, I think Charlotte showed you guys a quick little glimpse of what they're doing, but Aaron, we just basically wrapped up a movie. We also watched a Christmas movie, and then we also watched one of our shows, which was really good. And then now in the morning, um, hubby is deciding to put together Zoe's kitchen. We initially, we had the kitchen's been there for a while. We were gonna give it to her for her birthday, but we didn't get to get around to it. So we ended up giving her a bunch of other stuff because we basically could have chosen what we gave her. We basically had quite a few things to give her, and so I opted to just kind of save the the kitchen for the two more days after her birthday so Zoe's gonna be so thrilled when she sees it she's gonna be so so surprised anyways it is so late it's so early in the morning I need to get to bed so I can function and get some sleep but for some reason or another I'm experiencing like heartburn it's been happening a number of nights in a row so I yeah I need to take something for that because it's just not a very pleasant feeling I'm kind of, while they're downstairs, I'm kind of taking that time to kind of edit. So I find myself back in the spot talking to you because the light here is actually good. And also you guys, I'm so happy all the wrapping is done. Um, year after year, Aaron and I like to do a lot of the wrapping together. He always ends up doing a lot more than me because I always have the little ones. And you know, I'm always doing the mommy duties in the background. so. Sometimes I kind of have to kind of leave him and abandon him a little bit, but I always do my best to come and pick up. So he gave this whole wrapping business a head start yesterday and I made sure I came and kind of did my part today and wrapped a ton with him. So it's, things are a little bit different. We usually film the video together where you can see us both wrapping, but I, we just didn't get around to doing it this year. And things are a little bit different now that we have a baby and we got a whole little boy. <laughs> I'm gonna keep saying that because he, he is a very, he's a busy one. So I'm just very thrilled that we got all the wrapping out of the way. We bought all this nice wrapping paper and stuff. I mean, Christmas isn't about the gifts to begin with. Christmas is not about the gifts, as we all know, but it's a big part of our hearts. We love to gift, we love to give. We all, and with that, we always wanna wrap it in some cute wrapping paper. I'm just excited to see the look on their faces. And I'm also, and I will also um, share it with you. So thank you so much for tuning into today's vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed your Christmas Eve. And um, yeah, don't forget to subscribe if you guys are enjoying the vlogs. Um, like, comment, and share. And Merry Christmas. See y'all tomorrow.